Imagine seeing the human body from the inside out in groundbreaking high definition 3D. It's called CAVE or CAVE Automatic Virtual Environment and you don't have to imagine, you can just watch. It is being inside a person's body, but more than this, it is being inside organs in the person's body. The images you see were not shot on a movie set. It's not a laser light show or a video game. This is the cave. Now we are inside a cell. Cave is tucked inside a small room on the 13th floor of Weill Cornell Medical College in New York City. It's cutting edge technology that may revolutionize how we understand our bodies and treat diseases ranging from cancer to blindness. Time now to enter the three dimensional world of modern medicine. Let's go inside the cave. All right, Doc, what do we have? Oh, wow. We got a tour by Weill here? Cornell's Dr. Harel Weinstein. We can both walk straight into the image that we see. Wow, incredible. So that now we are inside this skull. Yeah, you probably can't appreciate this at home because you don't have the glasses on, but it is incredible. Cave builds on medical technology that's been around for decades, like the MRI, by using the 2D slides with a sophisticated network we of computers and cameras. Throughout your career, did you ever think something like this would be possible? I was dreaming about it, but I didn't think that I will be able to implement it and work with it. We are inside your eye, as if you were shrunk down and tossed inside the eye. It's helping physicians like Dr. Sislard Kish, an ophthalmologist who uses CAVE, to see the eye in ways never seen before. You're examining the relationship of these mounds to each other. By looking at this patient's retina in the CAVE, Dr. Kish was able to see the visible bumps of fluid that lay beneath the surface of the retina. And so the prognosis for visual recovery in this case is very good. It's a finding like this that gives hope to doctors and patients alike. To know that this exists has got to be, I would think, such a bright spot for medicine. It should give us all hope that we will understand more and therefore be able to do more for all of us. Now again, if you're not at home and you don't have 3D glasses on, it's a little difficult to, to really understand the concept uh, of just what dizzying? it was like being there. It, it was, to be honest with you, because you, it's like you're in this spacecraft and you're just kind of flying around right. all these planets almost. It was, it was really quite amazing, to be honest with you. And we, we have some more video here. Uh, basically, Dr. Keish said, you know what, let me, let me take a, a quick scan, a quick MRI of your eye. Your eye. So, so we basically went, hopped on the elevator, went down two floors, did a quick scan, took all of about five minutes, and before you know it, we are back up in cave. Take a listen to what went on. I'm glad to say everything looks normal. You can see how quickly we can... <laughs> that, was only, that was the only news I really needed to hear. <laughs> we can take a look at... But you can see that there is a scan of my eye right there, and it's just basically it's all these the layers, all Thinking these layers of the Thinking about seeing your own eye, seeing inside your own well, eye, well, that's just incredible. It. And that's what uh, you're, you're permitted to do with this technology. Years in the making, millions and millions of dollars, but incredible, incredible stuff.